I'm Darren Marlar, and this is a Weird Darkness Bonus Bite. From Paranormality Magazine, Painting of a Cursed Girl Sparks Intrigue and Online Frenzy by Brandon Grimes. A mysterious and unsettling painting of a young girl has caused quite a stir, earning a reputation as cursed after being returned twice to a charity shop due to its eerie vibes. The artwork, depicting a girl in a red dress with an uncanny facial expression and eyes that seemed to track observers, was donated to the Hastings Advice Representation Center, or HARC, shop in St. Leonard's on Sea. The painting's peculiar aura prompted two separate buyers to return it shortly after purchasing, citing its unsettling and creepy nature. The manager of HARC, Steve, confirmed the uncanny phenomenon of the painting's eyes seemingly following viewers around the room. The painting's origin story traces back to a middle-aged man who donated a collection of old pictures and frames, among which the eerie portrait was included. Upon first encountering the painting, Steve was taken aback by the strange expression on the girl's face, exclaiming, ''Oh my God, look at her face!'' Acknowledging its disconcerting quality, he agreed with a customer's observation that it had a creepy quality. The painting was initially sold for €25, Euro, but the initial buyer swiftly returned it, claiming it exuded an unsettling aura. In response, the painting was placed back in the shop window, this time with a markdown and a cautionary note about its potential curse. Despite the warning, another customer braved the purchase, securing the painting for €20. Euro. However, this buyer also soon returned the painting shaken and distressed, insisting she never wanted to see it again. The painting reappeared in the shop window, accompanied by a new note that humorously announced its return with the phrase, ''She's back! Sold twice and returned twice! Are you brave enough?'' The second buyer took to social media to share her experience, attracting attention from an international community of art enthusiasts who have a penchant for peculiar second-hand art pieces. The painting gained a devoted following as users shared their thoughts, with some suggesting it had an evil vibe. Others commented on its potential to bring misfortune. Amid the comments, the painting even earned comparisons to a young Nicole Kidman. The post's popularity eventually led the second buyer to reconsider. She returned to the shop, requesting to reclaim the painting due to its newfound online fame. Steve gladly obliged, letting her have the painting back for free eager to part ways with the unsettling artwork. In the end, this enigmatic painting of a little girl managed to capture the attention of both local shoppers and a global online audience, solidifying its place as an intriguing and memorable piece of art with a mystique that continues to captivate. See a photo of the painting and find the link to the original story in the show notes. And find more news in the Weird News and blog at WeirdDarkness.com.